hello guys welcome back again i'm your boy with this adam's link media welcome back to another freaky video so guys uh please try as much as possible to leave your comment like this video share it on all social media platform you can follow me on instagram twitter facebook at adam's link media make sure you subscribe and click that bell notification to get updates anytime i upload so guys uh we have so much to discuss today and uh, one of the few, uh, the main topic that I want to discuss, of course, you have already seen that the title of this video is uh, about uh, Whiskey, Bono Boy, and David O. You know, all those two guys, like, there are hot topics that I don't think we can stop talking about now or in the nearest future. And David O had a very explosive interview with Ibuka. And of course, a few few clips are coming out, and David Do apparently talked about his beef with Bono Boy, with Whiskey. And of course, that is when he revealed that there was a time that himself, Bono Boy, and Dami Cray were arrested by soldiers. And of course, soldiers beat them mercilessly. And also, he also said that uh, he loved Whiskey. And, so, and also he said, Bono Boy and him has no beef. He doesn't know why Bono Boy is coming after him. Simply because he decided to call himself and Whiskey the greatest of all time. And of course, he also recognized that the beef between them has actually exploded their career, himself and Whiskey. I told you guys, see. That's just the fact. I said it that this competition, this competition they are going through, is good for them. It's good for their business. It's really, really good. No matter. I know you guys be like, oh, they can just love each other. No, they can like each other, but the competition, the beef between them, is actually blowing them off the roof. So let us listen to where uh, David O talked about Bono Boy. <laughs> I mean, likes to pass his song, or Dugu is his nickname. Yes, it's going on now. But the yeah. song is not about him. But I'm okay. that line. Tell Dugu, say, we like to party, let's party, let's chill. Do you understand? Just call me. Yeah. Call me, call me. You are you day. I'm happy for you. I'm happy you're up. I'm happy you're rich. I'm happy for you. Everything, brother. Now, me and you supposed to run this P. What you talking? Now, me and you supposed to run this P now. What is the fight for? Now, nah, yeah, you're angry that. You're angry that I posted me a whiskey. Right? Abi? That well, not Bernard didn't say that. His guy told me. Let me not put words in his mouth. Yeah. His guy told me that. But you're a whiskey in London. Every day. So let me if they won't do all those joints together, come out, they no go work. I'm not fighting them. All those come together, it would not work with you. You think they're fighting you? Brother, it's clear. You, let's not be fake. For what's now? What are the three biggest in the game now? As at now. But do you understand? I'm born my bro. like Wizzy too. You're my brother, so I'm like, bro, what are we all doing? But I will not. One thing I don't go do, I don't go, I don't go stand down. No, I'm not a pussy, bro. Like, forget it. I'm not like, I'm not fighting you. But why are you fighting me for what, bro? I never said one thing bad about you. I never discredited you ever in my life. When last, just, when last did you hear from Bernard? Um, I saw Bernard. I saw Bonner like December. And you guys are still cool then? No, like I was like, when to, I was just hearing things, but I saw him we were cool, went to the club. This situation happened, bro. Just like bro, that's my brother. I, like, I don't want to fight nobody, bro. Yeah. I got kids, bro. I'm not trying to be violent and something happen. I have kids, bro. Do you but, understand? But do you, do you think your single has made things worse? <laughs> no, but I'm saying like bro, like like I'm saying, do you want to be violent or go into studio? I'm not going to see no event. I've always done it. Yeah. That's my P. Daily Mamadou, I did it. <laughs> Caroline, I did it. Abby? <laughs> I've always, my P is always been about my music P. I answer you with music. Do you understand? Forget violence. What do you want to do? You don't come shoot me. And uh, you see him. He said uh, the reason, the main reason why. I've come to him and say that uh, even if Whiskey and Bono Boy gang up against him, that is not going to work because he's not fighting anybody. 
Well, uh, let us listen to more of this interview. Then we cannot sit down and discuss about it more. <laughs> I have so many questions in my head. Oh, let's go. Well, you're, you're, you're 10 years in the industry. You are still at the top. Um, who do you see now as your... I don't use the word competition. But who do you look at and say, okay, this is my peer. Let me use that word. Tell the who said we I was hoping you were going to say that. So, wow. so let's talk burner. What's up? <laughs> let's talk burner. And let's talk femme. Um, what was femme about? Why is everybody asking what's femme about? Because they were. First of all, I want to disclose something. We cannot, two of us cannot sit in the room. Without any, like, only or so of us and fight or have an argument. Me and brother don't pass that P. But you can't, you, you can't listen to Femme and not think it's No, no, let me finish now. Brother, I was the happiest for Bonner's success. Because I know how, how, how many times people discredited him, blocked him. Do you know how many times I said, ah, if Bonner get a chance, I'm going to be number one. Do you know how many times I said it? Brother, I don't do it to anybody. If I don't do music today, all my brothers and sisters, they're richer than me. It's true now. If I go work for my, you know how many power plants we have? If I go work for my office, I'll be a billionaire tomorrow in dollars. That's, I'm doing this because I love the craft. Bonner is my brother, brother. I met Bonner like 2010, bro. Yes. I've, when I first bought my first Honda, Bonner, am I lying? I dropped me, Bonner, and Dami Craig. We drive, Bonner, am I lying? From um, uh, one hotel in VR, for, for, forgetting. One hotel, we go meet. Two face of grasshopper. We are me whole loss. Whole loss. <laughs> Do you know like? I'm sorry. Wait, I'm me vlog you. Uh, <laughs> the whole loss. I was, that time we never blow like that. The whole loss like this. Me, my dad. We go. We go where? Um, where camo. 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 Well, uh, it seems like uh, David Doe, Bono Boy really had a long history. You know, we just see the music, the uh, social media, all those internet stuff. We don't really see them hanging out together, like in secret. We can only see them posting videos about themselves. But they have actually gone through a lot. We never knew that uh, David Doe and Bono Boy knew each other. And they, were, and they were into that kind of situation when uh, so the, uh, Nigerian soldiers have to catch them and flog them simply because they were very camo. So, but now, you understand they are bigger and uh, of course they don't really send about all those things any longer. And of course, they can wear camo anyhow they like and no single soldier can do that to them. That's just the fact now. But then they were just upcoming. Of course, they were going to see Two-Face that that issue happened. So the basic fact is, like me, I've always said this. This competition is good as long as it's not violence, as long as nobody gets killed, nobody fight, all those kind of stuff. It's good for the business. It's good for the business. It makes them blow, it makes people talk about them, it makes people be like, okay, uh, the Bidou has released fame now, cursing out uh, Odogu, so we want to hear what uh, Odogu will do next. A lot of people will want to be interested in what Bono Boy will be putting out next. That's just the basic fact about it. So if uh, Bono Boy now has just drop music and say, I call it like Ferrari fake, or just do anything that has to do with David Doe stylishly, people will really want to go and watch that video, stream that video, buy that music, do things to that music. Ibu David Doe fan will go all the way to go and watch Bono Boy's song. And that is more money for Bono Boy. That is more fame for Bono Boy. The same thing happened to uh, David Doe when he released fame. Of course, definitely Bono Boy fans went there also to watch. Whiskey too, when they were having issue up to now. But it's clear though that Whiskey is like more a romantic situation with Bono Boy than David Doe. Whiskey can post Bono Boy song all day, support Bono Boy, but it can never support. It's hardly you see Whiskey posting anything about the video. It's hard, guys. Honestly, it's hard. You know, we'll see him. It go hard. 
And then apart from that, Davido also said Whiskey is his brother. That he has no beef with Whiskey too. That Whiskey is his own brother. Listen to him, guys. Um, I think from like. From like uh, me dropping my first album, things started like yeah. shaky and stuff like that. Do you think it was the fans, or do you think it was both of you? Did you start? Did you feel like you became competition? Of course. Yeah. Definitely. Do that, you think he felt that? Of course, he knows that, and that could be the only reason why he'd be vexing at me because I've never done nothing. I should, I, I said after having <laughs> <laughs> I've never done nothing before. <laughs> That's my brother. Like I'm a big. I love whiskey, bro. And, you know, I know he loves me too. He knows. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like, it's bullshit. But is the competition that caused it? Do you understand? Yeah. I think that's. Do you, is it on purpose? Because it froze. It froze the following. It froze the honestly, drama. Honestly, can I? Can I tell you? Can I ask something? Be honest with you. Yeah. Me? Did me and Wizzy's beef make us bigger? Probably. Yes, it did. So are you guys doing it on purpose? No, but I'm not. No. That's not that's not actually. Are you doing it on purpose? No. Do you think he's doing it on purpose? No, no, it's like it's really like it's my brother, but like there's really a problem. Yeah. That we need to fix. Yeah. Yes, I wanna go to Have you me. tried? I've tried, man. I've tried. Mm. Bro, I've tried to do an album with this. I tell you that. Oh, wow. I've tried to do a tour with this. Do you understand? Like we've spoken about last um Afro Nation. Yeah. Starboy and Texas Beach, we went to sit down have a like a general meeting. And sort every problem possible. It didn't happen. We made an album, so blah 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 blah. So just like, but like I keep saying, the problem no be for me. Do you understand? The problem is not for me. So. How would you describe whiskey now? What do you mean now? Like how would you de- in this moment? How would you describe whiskey? No stress. Huh? No stress. No stress. Yeah. Chilling. I was saying to Olamide the other day. Olamide was in like uh, two days ago. I was, talking, I was like, damn, well, I'm just reminiscing from how long we've, how far we've come. Damn. I think when we really sit down and think about the blessings, no going to Yeah. But honestly, I'm saying this camera. I don't get any problems. <laughs> That's the honest truth. Yeah. Do you understand? So, do you think we're ever going to get a collab? Honestly, I think a collab should have happened since. But now, I mean, I don't care. If you come, you drive. No one drive. No one drive. No one drive. <laughs> All I know is he hits them like a Many. Yeah. Sir. So, okay. <laughs> <laughs> You've been in the music industry for how long? Well, guys, uh, it seems like uh, for those of you who have been saying, oh, why is there no collaboration between Whiskey? David Doe, uh, you see, David Doe said he has tried severally to reach out to Whiskey so that they can have an album or do a tour together, but it never ever happened. Not from his own side, though. I, he keeps saying that it's not his fault that he has tried severally to try to do it, but it's not happening. But right now, it's just chilled. Well, guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. At least one of the party David Doe has been able to come outside. To narrate exactly what is transpiring between himself, Bono Boy, and Whiskey. And definitely you can see there's no much long beef. Like I've said, the competition is good, but the beef aspect when they are fighting all those kinds of things is not what I will appreciate. I would really love in this lifetime to see the collaboration between David O, Bono Boy, and Whiskey, together and so many other artists out there. I would love to see that collaboration. Man, no time to be, but the competition is okay for me with me. When it comes to the competition, I wholeheartedly support it. So guys, thank you very much for watching. Try as much as possible to leave your comment and then follow me on social media at Adam's Link Media on the Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and make sure you subscribe and click that bell notification. Bye, have a wonderful day.